Hello my handsome and sexy dirty bastards, welcome back to my channel. So you are here because you want to drop some panties with your fragrance. Bitch, I'm stylish. Black talk, big t-shirt, Billy. Watch on my wrist, but I want that diamond. Ooh, yeah. But honestly, it doesn't work like that. Yes, I can only help you with smelling amazing. But style, your body and social skills, those are all the things that you need to work on to drop the panties eventually. So you gotta work on those things yourself. But to not let you down so much, I can at least help you with saving money. Today I'm giving 200 people a gift because I've partnered up with Max Aroma. I got a $10 gift card, use the code CURLY10. And I also got a $20 gift card, use the code CURLY20. This code will only be valid for two weeks and only 200 people can use them. And the code can be applied to anything. Doesn't matter if there's already a sale on it. So make sure you don't miss out on this amazing deal. Max Aroma will be linked in the description. Now gentlemen, grab yourselves a cup of coffee and put your balls in a good position. And let's get into it. All right, gentlemen, now I actually got 13 fragrances, but first three on this list is discontinued. So I hope you can still get them because they are amazing, but that's the reason why they are so far on the list. So number 13, 12 and 11 are discontinued, but they're still amazing. And that's why they are on this list. So at number 13, we got Yves Saint Laurent, La Nuit de l'Homme, Blue Electrique, AKA. Fuck it right in the pussy. Yes, this one is amazing. And if you're doing it good, it's truly a panty dropper. This is like La Nuit de Long, stronger, put in a new jacket with a little bit more of a freshness to it. I even smell Coca-Cola vibe in it, love it. And the main notes that you smell are cardamom, ginger, lavender, cedar, and vetiver. It is clean, soft, and sexy spicy, very sensual and elegant. And the longevity is a little bit better on this one. This one is six to eight hours with a moderate projection. But if you can't find this one, then just get the original La Nuit de Lom and just spray a lot. Or get Ted Lapidus Poker Face, also a good one. It's a more powdery version of La Nuit de Lom and even more spicy and stronger. All right, and at number 12, we got Prada Luna Rosa Black. Yes. Sweet, warm, cozy, and spicy powdery. Very alluring to the girls. If girls smell this on you, you smell different. They want to smell it again and again. They do everything to take another sniff off of you. And the main notes that you smell are bergamot, patchouli, comarin, amber, and musk it gives this mysterious vibe off of you and girls love mysterious kind of guys because they want to figure you all out this smells like dr pepper with spicy powdery notes that's basically what this is and the longevity with this one is an easy eight hours with a moderate projection try it out and at number 11 this one is amazing and they should have never discontinued this and i know that a lot of people are trying to find this one it is muggler pure malt sweet Boozy, unique, and definitely a nighttime fragrance. And the main notes that you smell are fruity notes, malt, whiskey, patchouli, and cedar. This fragrance is very boozy. Like boozy, boozy. And girls love some booze all over them. This is a kind of a bad boys fragrance, but then for grown-ups. Like you're in your 30s and up. The man who I describe wearing this is the guy from Mad Men, Don Draper. That's this guy. People can't place what they are smelling off of you, but this one does give a lot of compliments and attention. And the longevity is a good eight hours with a moderate to a little bit above average of projection try this one out all right and we're finally at the fragrances that you can still buy at number 10 we got mason martin margella jazz club a sweet 
boozy tobacco fragrance. And if you know the fragrance Dolce & Gabbana, the one, see this as a more of a niche version of that fragrance. And a little bit stronger than that one as well. And the main notes that you smell are tobacco, rum, vanilla, and styrox. Now also this one. It is a soft scent, but this is a Netflix and chill kind of a scent. You don't want it to be strong. You want it to be a little bit softer because it works in Netflix and chill kind of a occasions. Longevity with this one is six hours and it is soft, but if you want it to project more, if you're not going to wear this, a Netflix and chill kind of occasions, but if you're going to wear this one out, spray 20 sprays, layer it with ISO E Super, and then it stays the whole day. Try this one out. And at number nine, we got Armani Code Absolute. Sweet, powdery, sexy, and perfect for date nights. And when this is on man's skin, it's even sexier. Then it really comes to life. This one is like mature and playful at the same time. Vanilla, tonka bean and suede leather are the main notes that you are going to get with this fragrance. And the longevity with this one is around eight hours with a moderate projection. Try this one out. And at number eight, we got Givenchy Pie. Sweet, unique, oriental gourmand fragrance. And the main notes that you're going to smell are mandarin orange, vanilla, almond, tonka bean, and a sexy benzoin. I always say, that this is the captivating underdog. And you will also make the ladies very happy when you wear this one. It doesn't matter the age, so make them happy. What makes you happy? What brings you joy? Sex. <laughs> I don't know what you're into, but that's a dirty old bastard right there. Now this fragrance leans very unisex, but girls love unisex kind of fragrances on a man. Those are the most sexiest. They feel comfortable with scents like that. And the longevity with this one is a good eight hours, but it is very soft. So you know in what kind of occasions you need to wear this. Try this one out. And at number seven, we got the cheap one, Ted Lapidus Altamir. Sweet baby powder, floral, soft fragrance. Very floral, actually, but it doesn't smell feminine. Now the main notes you're going to smell are neroli, orange blossom, jasmine, tonka bean, amber, and musk. And this one smells a lot like Jean Paul Cotier number two, but then a little bit more floral and lighter. It's also much lighter. Now, I don't know why, but this fragrance is extremely overlooked and underrated. But for the price and milliliter that you're going to get this one, like this one is 125 milliliter and it's mass appealing, sweet and elegant. What would you want more? Now what you would want more is that the longevity and projection would be a little bit better. But for a cheap fragrance, 125 milliliters, just spray it again. Longevity is around four to six hours with a soft projection. But just respray, throw it in your bag and it's good. Try this one out. And at number six, we got Invictus Victory. My favorite Invictus. It is peppery, chocolatey, very sweet and powdery with some fresh edges. It's good. And the main notes you're going to smell for this fragrance is pink pepper, lemon, vanilla, tonka bean, and lavender. Now this has a vibe of Roja Enigma, of Armani Code Profumo, and Ox Dark Chocolate. So if you like those three fragrances, that's basically what you're going to get in this one, but then 10 times better than all of them. This is that kind of a fragrance that girls really like to smell on a man. So really don't underestimate this fragrance. Don't underestimate it. Just go for it because the longevity is easy eight to 10 hours with a good to moderate projection. Try this one out. And at number five, we got Initio Rehab. This is spicy, woody, powdery, and creamy. This is for the girls who like some cream all over them. And the main notes that you smell are lavender, citrus, cedar, sandalwood, musk, and Gaia wood. Now, this is definitely a take on the original Spice Bomb. You smell that in here, but then a 10 times better version of it. It is smoother, a bit fresher, Spice Bomb perfected. So basically this is a playboy in his 30s with a lot of money, 
but still isn't done yet playing with a lot of ladies. A very, very addictive scent. And if you get the extra bucks to spend on it, do it. Now projection is above average and the longevity is an easy 10 plus hours. Try this one out. And at number four, we get the Casanova fragrance with some extra coffee. We get Montal's Restretto Intense Café. Mm, sweet, dark, caramel coffee. If you would order that at a coffee shop and you would smell it, you would get it. That's this. But then a more perfumed version of it. Smells amazing. And girls like this kind of a coffee as well. And the main notes that you smell are roasted coffee beans, rose, vanilla, caramel, white musk, and amber. And because you smell more coffee in this than the normal Intense Café, it makes it more mature and a little bit more manly. The coffee note will at least last for three hours and then you will get the normal Intense Café again. But this one is even stronger than the normal Intense Café. So I already told you, like Intense Café is 16 plus hours, projects like a beast, it is beast mode. So can you imagine how this one is? Pff, longevity with this one is even like 20 hours and it's beast mode. This one is amazing and you need to have it in your collection if you like Intense Café or if you want an upgrade with Intense Café. This one is amazing. Try this one out. And at number three is for the oud lovers out there or people who want to dive into oud because this one is a very likable oud. This is the best oud fragrance at the moment. It is Odeon Dubai Scorpion Intense. Wow, 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 wow. I keep telling you, if you still don't have this one, what are you doing? This is the fragrance that you wear if you want to smell like money, if you want to smell rich, if you want to have compliments, if you want to make an impression on the woman. That's this one. If you want the sexiest oud fragrance out there, the oud fragrance which is going to give you the most compliments out of all the oud fragrances, then you really need to have this one in your collection. Like all the people who have bought this one because of me have told me how amazing this one is and how many compliments they are getting with this one. That's how amazing this is. Amazing this one is and how many compliments they are getting. Now this is Airy Oud, it's not skanky at all. The quality is like top notch. It is not going to leave your skin and this projects like a mofo. That's why you're also getting a lot of compliments with this one because everybody is going to smell this. And the main notes you're going to smell are Oud, berries, rose, amber, Batola Wood, incense and saffron. So if you want beast mode Oud fragrance, which is going to get a lot of compliments, then try this one out. And at number two, woo, we got Gisada's Ambassador Intense. Yep, has to be on this list. It's amazing. A better, darker, sexier version of the original. Oh, and spicier as well. Now the face of this fragrance is also Michel Marone, the guy who plays in the movie 365 days. So if you want to smell like a sexy mafia boss, this is it. Like this is something, if you like the original, if you have the original, you are going to love this one as well. You're going to love this one even more. That's how good this one is. And this one is super, super masculine. Like this one is super sexy, masculine, but I don't wear this one. This one is too masculine for me. I really want to smell this on a man during sexy time. And the main notes you're going to smell with this one is mandarin, grapefruit, cardamom, pink pepper, licorice, cinnamon, tonka bean, leather, oak moss, and musk. Look, you have those making love kind of a night, you know, you have those nights, but this, bruh, this is the rough nights. That's what this one is. Longevity with this one is easy 12 to 16 plus hours and also with a massive projection. This is not going to leave your skin. And um, if you also like some rough nights, try this one out. I make the bed and she gives me... Happiness? Happiness can't suck my... Oh man, he's doing it all wrong. The only thing he had to do was spray a little bit of this S Boy by Draco at number one. Because this one has been proven to do this. Ooh, 
tropical sexiness. This is. This is tropical, fresh, powdery and very luxurious. This is that fragrance, fresh, clean. You spray this one on when you come out of the shower, ready to take care of business. That is how this one smells and girls absolutely love this. And the main notes you're going to smell of this fragrance is lemon, peach, coconut, rose, iris, lavender, musk, vanilla, and tonka bean. This fragrance smells like Rose's Musk from Arabian Oud, Baccarat Rouge, Serge of Corallo, and Serge of Herba Pura. If you would mix all that together, you will get this. Now this is just very, very sexy. It's basically sex in a bottle. That's what this one is. And this is a fragrance that you can wear all year round. So basically you smell good anytime that you want. Winter, summer, it doesn't matter. This is it. And the longevity of this fragrance is easy, eight to 10 hours with a moderate projection. Now, and if you wanna have the sex in the bottle fragrance, your curly girl also got a code for you guys. Use the code curly and you will get a $35 off. Get it. Sexy gentlemen, this was the fragrance video of today. Hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments down below, what is your ultimate panty dropper? Because your curly girl wanna know which ones helped you. And I will see you in the next video. Mwah. Bye-bye.